Welcome to our video walkthrough of our Delta Darwin 2011 3512 three bed caravan. It's got double glazing and gas central heating and it's priced at £15,395. So showing you the living room area here, we've got a fitted L-shaped sofa, corner suite there. Upholstery is free, free from any sort of big rips or anything, um, just a little bit grubby in places on the cushions and on the arms. Got a wooden coffee table there. Which I think is a is a um, added item. It doesn't really go with the rest of it, but I think just a simple wooden coffee table there. Got an electric fireplace over here with coffee coffee a TV unit in the corner there. We've got obviously as I said gas central heating. So we've got two radiators actually in this area, one there and one next to it. And we've got a fitted dining area um, seating plus freestanding table and a couple of stools. The upholstery, as I say, is all right. Just going to give you a bit of a look at the arms. There's a bit greasy sort of on the arm and then running over the cushions here. Just a little bit sort of stained in places there. So it could do with a really good clean. I'm sure that would bring it up, but um, it's otherwise okay. Stepping towards the kitchen area, we I've opened these cupboards here because you've got a fitted fridge and a fitted freezer. Just highlight those in the kitchen. And you've got a microwave shelf over in the corner there. These sort of white creamy coloured um, units which are nice and modern. Gas hob and oven as usual and grill. Stepping towards the external door, uh, which is just one that comes into the caravan, we've got a little cupboard unit to the side, which is just sort of extra handy storage. And then this door here, by our external door, houses our combi boiler for our central heating. Walking down our hallway, we've got a door that separates off the living quarters from the bedroom quarters at the back. We're going to go to the back of the caravan as usual and poke our nose into the main bedroom. Good storage in here, You've got bedside tables, uh, or bedside cupboards rather, above the bed. You've got a nice shelving unit in between and then bedside tables either side. And then we've got our long wardrobe there, little mirror unit and uh, little desk unit there with gas central heated radiator carpet in here is um, is alright, it's a bit stained really and a bit worn um, it's different to the bedroom next to us so I, one of them's been changed at some point um, but step into uh, the back of the caravan here, next to our main bedroom we've got one of our twin rooms which has got the same style shelf and cupboard units over the bed gas radiator and then a, um, a half um, cupboard that goes down behind the radiator there so you can see that's just a bedside table in there but it goes lower there from the hanging rail um, there but as you can see it's just a um, half door stepping out of there I'm gonna just finish off the third bedroom by walking back up towards the kitchen area and swivel in here show you the second twin room same style, um, obviously uh, shelving unit there and uh, cupboard doors and, and all that sort of stuff. So that's obviously a longer wardrobe than the other one in terms of the door anyway. Um, so that's the second twin room. So twin bedrooms, fairly explanatory there. Um, our bathrooms are split. So we've got a, a shower and sink unit in this one. Nice shower unit actually with a good sized door as you can see there chrome shower door unit and then you've got these um, sort of aqua board walls and it's also the same on the ceiling quite a nice colour actually we've got a gas radiator in here and then spinning round we've got sink and then we've got sort of a splash back with the same style as the uh, aqua board in the um, shower there Stepping out of there and going down our hallway, uh, we've got the toilet and basin in here. So sink and shower in one room and then toilet and shower in the other. All clean and tidy. 
just to highlight that floor and again in the living room area as i said i think probably had carpet before they've changed for vinyl you can see the difference between the um, kitchen vinyl which runs through the hallway as well and into the bathrooms compared to the living room and you can also see that from the carpet bar there is obviously a thicker flooring that's been put down um, compared to the original not an issue but just um, just obviously highlighting that so that's our kitchen living area bedrooms and bathrooms I'm just going to jump outside now and just show you the exterior of the caravan tapes just left over from transport so it's not damaged or anything but the panels are all look quite clean down the sides there's a gas regulator on the rear here but we always remove them because you obviously need to get a gas safe engineer to commission it and fit a regulator for you and do it properly a um, bit of markings on the side here and down here um, which is just where they've had decking and obviously slapped some oil on there or stain on there um, which hopefully will clean off we always obviously give that a go and then just to drop down and show you the chassis it's a standard painted chassis some surface rust on it but it's all uh, solid there we obviously check those things ourselves anyway, but there are no problems there by the looks of it. So that is our Delta Darwin 3512 3 bedroom caravan. It's from 2011. It's got double glazing, gas entry heating, and it's priced at 15395